finally made it here. We've been waiting weeks for them to do our roofing. Yes, fine. So I guess I'm probably gonna be parking on the street. <laughs> but yeah, they finally made it here. It's like maybe two or one more pallet left of our roofing material. Let's see. So this is what I'm up to today. They finally came. It's been months waiting for them, the backlog to get our roof done and they came knocking on the door about 6 30 maybe 6 40. yeah gosh that sky is so beautiful they have made good work it's a lot of roof Well, this is what I'm doing. I'll see y'all in a new video today. When you want me to do it, you pay them. If not, I'll pay somebody else. They pretty much got this done in one day. I think they only have maybe a little bit left. Even on the other side of the house, it's completely done. Amazing. This grass looks so bad, oh my gosh. Look how much is grown up. We haven't cut it in about two, close to three weeks now. We'll never let it get like this, but. Y'all, the motor on the lawnmower went out. So now we have nothing to cut our grass with. They are finished with my roof. I'm gonna have to go up on it on the hill so you can see it. About to go into this garden. Try to weed a little bit. Oh, my allergies are bothering me, so I don't know. But that's my roof. Now we gotta get the house pressure washed to match the roof, but Everything happens when it's supposed to happen. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm about to start painting. I just wanted to do an overall view of what everything is looking like right now and the areas that I will be painting. I'm trying to go slow because I don't want anybody to be dizzy. So we were gonna go with white paint, but we decided on gray instead, not a dark gray though. This area I will not be painting right here because we still have a little bit more work to do with the drywall, but everything else I will be painting. First, I'm gonna start with lining, outlining the walls and stuff like that. Um, so I'm gonna have to, and I hate using a ladder, but I'm gonna have to use a ladder to get up there and paint in the trim part of it. So I'm not looking forward to that because I have this thing with heights and stuff. Oh, 
Okay, let me stop right here. This was a bad idea and I did not go through with it. It kept sliding down, so that's a no. <sighs> Y'all, when I first bought this paint, it was just straight white. We decided to do a gray, so I chose agreeable gray as the gray for our walls, not a dark. People knew her by her will To make it whatever she put her mind to Late night hours up the hill Serving coffee to strangers Talking about revenue She kept dreaming of a world Big enough for everyone But she knew it must rain before it grows she kept dreaming all the day, butterflies survived the wheel Even though she could knock down and never showed doggone ladder that kept sliding down. I'm going to give it up eventually, y'all. I'm going to give it up eventually. So if y'all haven't seen me do my kitchen video, y'all see it showing right there. Y'all go check that video out. Your girl is trying to do her thing, okay? Y'all, I'm about to get this thing cranked up. Okay, I know it seemed like it's going at a slow pace, but hey, I'm going to speed it up throughout the video. So y'all, when you have like a homestead, you're doing like 50, 11 million things. So I forgot to feed the chickens and the rabbits. So I ran out to feed the chickens real quick and I decided to record them and stick it in here. So let's get back to painting. You, you've been hiding in the shadows way too long. You, always thought that you were weak, but babe, you're wrong. Yeah, you. So backstory, we've been living with our house for me in shambles and I could no longer take just sitting and watching it and waiting, you know, to do a little bit every time my husband comes off of the road, he is a truck driver. So I said, you know what, you've done it before, it's been years, but you can do it again. Just, you know, take the fear away and get it done. And it was so rewarding to do. And I think when my husband saw the what I was doing, he was like, I'm a 
come home a little bit early so I can help you. So I really appreciate that as well. yourself cause you're a work of art you you should know that you are perfect with those flaws so right now i'm just edging out around the vent later my husband did clean that vent because it is filthy that spark out you've been hiding in the shadows way too long the baseboard and stuff so I don't get that gray paint on it. I know it probably doesn't look gray but it I promise you it is gray but I didn't want a dark gray like we have down in the basement so I decided I would um, do agreeable gray is what it is called again and I did down by the baseboards around the TV until my daughter came home and then helped me take the TV down. about y'all tackling my fireplace I haven't convinced my husband I feel like it's gonna be something that I do when he's away to start it out that way you know he'll have to be on board because I'll have already started it <laughs> this next clip is where I sent it to my husband I think that's what made him be like hey I want in on this I want to make it this look is good how far too I've gotten T got off early so I'm having Stop and go get her. I like it. That's just one coat though. So of course we gotta do another coat. I'm just trying to get this one coat on and we can get the other coat tomorrow when you get home. As you can see, we have taken the TV down, my daughter and I, and I'm trying to get as much done as I possibly can before my husband gets in. Um, that way he can just go over and do like the second coat or whatever. I don't think we'll need a third coat at this point.
My husband is going to do the edges at the top of the wall when he gets in, um, well, he did the next day. I don't know why I felt the need to touch up around the TV stand. It's not going to be seen. But see the, the fireplace here? I really want to change that up and keep the, the river rock at the bottom, but maybe put a cement board at the top and then put some kind of bead boarding over that as a design. So I don't know. I'm thinking about it, you guys. Let me know what you think down in the comments. So right here I'm just edging out all of the light fixtures for the fireplace, etc. It actually looks like I haven't painted right here in this area, but I did, so I'm gonna have to do another coat of paint there so it will match everything else. So now I'm about to start on the other side of the wall, like where the entryway is. And there's certain areas that I will not be painting, like the corners here where my husband still has to do the drywall. Um, right here and then of course by the front door as well but I'm about to paint this section of the wall like I said I'm trying to get as much done as I possibly can before my husband gets in the following day uh, so we can actually finish it out yes y'all see my dehydrator because I'm about to get deep back into my homestead and on this channel so what I'm about to do now is start edging out around the window sill and the top by the ceiling and also the baseboards before I get into the bulk of the wall. I wanted to escape for a while Thought that a couple of drinks could ease my mind I've been thinking of you for two weeks straight I know that I need to get myself back in the game Someone said your name had a ton of room Suddenly you're there standing in the crowd Everything comes back in the blink of an eye It's like you're mine, you're still mine Baby, skip the small talk Cause you know me better than I Know myself on my speed a while now Since I saw you But it feels like yesterday somehow Time has stopped, nothing's changed We're the same Small talk, cause you know me better 
Ryan's gonna be here tomorrow. He's gonna get in here and start helping me with the second coat. Um, and I'm gonna finish up doing first coat with Aries while he's doing that. Of course, you gotta come back and finish fixing this drywall so that we can get it primed and painted. I'm not gonna paint in this area right here on the corner. I'm just gonna stop right there at that area so that he can uh, come back in and fix it and then we'll paint it. Watch them grow, the light will always know. 
So as you can see, my husband CJ is in. He didn't waste any time with getting started and he's edging up where I did not get or I didn't get well enough. And he's also going to be doing the second coat. I think one wall we had to do a third coat or whatever, but I'm just glad to have some help in here now because I'm going to be focusing on the kitchen area over by those bay windows right there. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh no. Tell me you having fun. So I took a five minute break and I was watching m.r.tv. Y'all check out their channel, it's so funny. So let's recap some of the things that I did that I did not record because it just takes so much time to record. We finished up the living room. Um, we touched it up, put the TV back up. I did over by the bait windows. They look really good. I did over the cabinets that I just repainted and stuff, but I'm going to redo that again once we take the cabinets down. I did the hallway. I did over by my daughter's room. I did not do where the laundry room is. I still have to get that done. I did this area, but I did not complete it all. Well, I need to do a second coat. So what had happened was... I decided, me alone, I needed to have a focal wall because I wanted to break things up. And y'all remember, I said, I think I'm going to do something with that fireplace. I just haven't figured it out yet. So I decided we had some gray, gray paint, not gray blue like we have in the basement. I'm over the gray blue down there. It's too much of it. I'm actually going to paint the basement as well. So you'll see that video. Um, I haven't started yet. But I decided, I said, ask my husband. He said, yeah, I think it'd be a good idea. So I started doing this myself. And then he came in and he, you know, edged for me the baseboards. I think he did the baseboards. I can't remember the baseboards. And I know up by the top of the ceiling because I just, you know, want to make sure I had it where I needed it to be. And I thought it brought it together. Waited all my life for someone like you to show Now that you're mine, it's so hard to take things slow Oh Don't wanna wait another day, don't wanna fire to fade to glow And high we go I'm flying light as a feather When we're together I'm falling like a domino I wanna scream and shout Keep it up all night I wanna scream and shout Keep it up all night I wanna scream and shout Until we get it right Now the tables are turned and I climb right out as well oh, oh, oh. Someone grand and I bleed like a coin in a wishing well We're going under the weather, harder than ever, higher than high we go I'm 
y'all let me know what y'all think down below and with the floors we're thinking we want to sand the floors down and stain it a brownish color or should we leave it like this um just let me know but i'm always interested to hear others opinions and thank y'all for watching i hope y'all enjoy each and every moment of this hard work
my life. 